Hello, this is Dr. Drew Hall with Upper Cervical Healthcare of Los Angeles and Carson. Today, what I want to talk about is something called plagiocephaly. Now, that's the technical word. The lay term is a misshapen head. You know, there's a large percentage of kids these days who have the f a flat back of their head. One side of their head is misshapen compared to the other. And there's several reasons why this is happening. But what I want to try and get through is there are other things that you can do other than putting a helmet on your kid's head and applying asymmetrical pressure to try and shape their head back to how it should be. The reason that the kid has a misshapen head isn't because they weren't wearing a helmet on their head. And if I sound a little bit passionate about this, I am because our system of healthcare is always looking at how do we treat an effect instead of looking at what's the underlying cause. So one of the underlying causes of kids with plagiocephaly is their sleeping. So some kids, uh, they sleep only on one side and the reason maybe they're only sleeping on one side is they have suffered birth trauma. So as they came out the birth canal, they had an upper cervical misalignment, the top vertebra in the neck, which is this guy, called the atlas, it weighs two ounces, the head weighs 10 pounds. And when the kid's coming out the birth canal, sometimes, the child gets stuck and so they have to do a vacuum extraction or they have to do a forceps delivery. These types of in, that type of delivery applies anywhere from 40 to 60 pounds of stress and pressure to the upper cervical spine and that can dislodge the top vertebra in the neck. Now when the upper neck vertebra locks even with an infant, the muscles become asymmetric on one side. They become tighter on one side compared to the other and you may notice uh, if you think about your child, if you're having these problems that you notice that they carry their head off one side, not the other, they turn their head one way, not the other. And this makes the two things happen. A, they have tighter muscles on one side of the neck and cranium compared to the other. And B, uh, when they sleep at night, they're more comfortable on one side versus the other. So they always choose to lie on the right side or their left side. And if you do that from when you're born on, you're gonna find that the pressure of sleeping 16 hours a day and in combination with those muscles being tight, it causes the head to be misshapen. So there's two things. A, when your child is born, they should all be checked uh, by a qualified upper cervical chiropractor to see whether they have their upper neck misaligned or not. So this problem doesn't happen in the first place. I know that is way outside of some people's comfort zone, but birth trauma is very common. There was a study done in Germany where they found 82% of kids delivered in the hospital had an upper cervical spine misalignment. So as a preventative measure, not only for a misshapen head, but your central nervous system controls and coordinates everything in your body. It is what um, produces development in a kid as a kid develops speech, crawling, all these things are all coordinated uh, by the central nervous system. And so correcting the upper cervical spine is paramount if there's trouble. There's lots of kids that are born into this world they don't have an upper cervical spine injury. Now, if your child already has um, plagiocephaly and a misshapen head, they still can be helped. But the sooner you get to it, the better. Uh, you need to get someone who's qualified to, to assess the upper cervical spine to determine whether there's a problem, and if there is, fix it. And then, of course, their sleeping posture, you can do things to modify how they're sleeping. But what we find generally is when the upper cervical spine is corrected and the muscle tone in these young kids uh, balances their sleeping posture is no longer stuck in one side. And generally, the muscle tone starts to change and heal and repair. And in many of these cases, the head will start to um, become more symmetrical. Now, like I said earlier, the sooner you can get to it, the better. Um, to correct these problems. If you are someone in the Los Angeles area who knows someone or is, has a kid that is dealing with this, we do offer a free consultation. Uh, we have two offices. Our Los Angeles office is 213-399-7772 and our Carson office is 310-324-6172. We'd love to uh, help out so these kids can develop normally down the road. Again, thanks for listening.